Ray Davis. A wet night for Act 3 of a 10-day drama of Cup, League and now Cup again. And the introduction of two new characters to the starting lineups. For Wimbledon, Dean Holdsworth, who hasn't played a full 90 minutes this season, joins the team strengthened compared with Saturday's league match here against Middlesbrough by the return of the Norwegian Eivind Leonardsson. For Manchester United, Andy Cole, who scored the winner last Wednesday in the league match between these two teams, is preferred to Oleg Gunnar Solskjaer, who was unlucky not to score a hat-trick in that match and indeed set out the chance that Cole eventually took. Roddy Johnson fit again, returns to the defence, and with Paul Scholes unfit, was a place for Karol Poborski. King had it for a moment. Nicely held up. Jones, too strong for Earl. Holdsworth. And Hudson. And no flag went up. And the chance was not taken by Efren Okoku. Well, he might have just been level, but I have to say it was a very close one. And Cantona takes them on. Cole landed too strongly at his feet. Giggs. Cantona couldn't make contact. And away by Earl. A move of French orchestration. Kicks his cross, and Cantona felt that he was pushed then as he challenged for the ball, but the referee unimpressed. And Gary Neville, good save, good recovery. Denying a man who's never scored for Manchester United. Lively stuff. This attack shouldn't have been allowed to go on as long as it did, though. Had four chances then take the ball away Cantor. good turn by Gale pass didn't match it poor clearance by Jonsson Koku and Leonardson they've had two clear chances Wimbledon first to Koku's head and the second from Koku to Leonardson's feet Irwin Goal. Beckham! Blocked by Blackwell. Support coming up on the left side, but Akoku goes past Irwin. Chance to recover. And Schmeichel did well. And they left. Three in the box. This is Cantona. And that's a good save. Side of it. Yeah. Kick is to Wimbledon. The referee won't allow it to be taken from there. Five up on the edge of the area. Two just outside, and Schmeichel claims with ease. Beckham. Borski right, Cole and Giggs now left, Beckham! Uh, we saw it from Keane in the first half. Corner, Jones to supply. Koku on the edge of the six-yard area, this is Holdsworth! Enough to make Michael Scurry. Good as the first half chances. But even so, he got there first, turned it aside. Almost a great ball. Right by Perry. It's a rattling good cup tie. On a February night of now incessant rain. 
Nobody on the goal line for their corners. They haven't changed that in spite of the failure last week. Ballastar is blocked. Best from Sullivan on the night. Pallister really met that with the meat, and he's up here again. And Cole appealed for handball, it came off Perry's arm, but accidental. But the back pass was with the forearm, I believe. This was a good stop, really good stop. Pallister making it his. Got what they wanted. Here comes the throw. Away goes a Koku. Earl Gale, Holdsworth, Leonardson. All waiting for the ball in the middle. And it could come now at a good angle. And his goal! <laughs> at last for Wimbledon. And the marking was poor. But the header was strong, and the goal is a delight for Wimbledon. Janssen. Cantona. Had to come back across. Vinnie Jones. McClare. In comes Beckham. Jones to take the free kick. And we're in the first minute of stoppage time. And it was blocked by Goodman from Akoku. Keane. McClare. Beckham forward. Manchester United followers willing their team to save themselves at the death here. Giggs. Cantona, it's a corner. And up comes Schmeichel. In their hour of need, he's up. But it's hit a long way back. Ah! Schmeichel! But he's offside! He's offside! It's not going to count. He scored once before. European competition, but he was clearly offside here as the ball has won at the back, and there's all sorts of trouble going on as we look at the replay. It was Pallister's header, but Schmeichel clearly offside. It's a magnificent attempt by him, but it doesn't stand. On by Vinnie Jones. Blackwell underneath it. Cantona. Away by Harfin. Half away by Jones. Keane. Neville. Beckham makes the overlap. Barrister was pushed down. Well, Wimbledon are very lucky to get away with that. Here's Pallister again. Put out for the corner by Perry. Not prepared to take any chances. Up comes Schmeichel again. If it is to be the end, it's a magnificent end by United going down, fighting. Away by Koku. Might have scored at the beginning. But that's not to be the last clearance. Still more time on Graham Pohl's watch. Neville to take the throw. Three around Pallister. Jones hoisted into the night sky. And Wimbledon have beaten Manchester United. The cup holders are out, and there is the scorer. Marcus Gale in the 63rd minute. And Vinnie Jones has led his side to a memorable victory. Neil Sullivan, a magnificent save from Pallister. And you have to say, as last week, when Alec Ferguson's side deserved to win the league match, tonight, Wimbledon have deserved to win the cup match.
Manchester United's run comes to an end.